Every inch of snowfall is another inch toward history for the Twin Cities. It also adds to the cost for you, the taxpayer. WCCO's Jonah Kaplan reports on how bills keep piling up for cities and counties because of the record snowfall. This is why we pay taxes, but no city council or county commission gets advance notice on Mother Nature's plans. The city of Minneapolis this year budgeting a little more than $11.5 million for snow operations. This historic winter, though, raising the projected expenses to at least $12.5 million. Anoka County, meanwhile, already spending an extra quarter million dollars on salt supplies. And that doesn't include the price of putting it on the streets. In Burnsville, the Public Works Director explaining the challenges, it's the normal stuff just on steroids. The blades need to be changed out more often, the cutting edges, uh, hydraulic systems, we've had failures there. Aside from the cost, there's a human toll too. Do I miss my kids' basketball game this weekend to come in and plow? Yes, they do. The thing about public works services, they have to be done. A city, county, public works department, of course not the only entity doing some plowing. There are hundreds of landscaping companies that in the winter do plowing. Peter Duran here, they have 1,000 residential accounts. They're tired too. For the first time in 30 years, the company's plow driver is making more trips than the high number given on a seasonal contract. We got to keep going out. We got to keep paying guys. We got to keep putting fuel on the trucks. We're here to serve our customers. At the same time, it's obviously more work. Jonah Kaplan, WCCO 4 News. Many budgets are done on a calendar year, so the big financial picture won't be known until December 31st.